start here, we're going to say, when we see a crazy problem like this, with all these X's in the problem, one thing we can do is think about it like a fraction. We basically have 3 and 4 on top of two other numbers. These numbers are not the same, so we take the 8 and multiply it top and bottom of this side, and we take this 5 multiply it top and bottom. This gives us 8 times 3, 24. 5 times 4, 20. So then you add those across, giving this. In the same way, we look at this problem. We say this x plus 2 has to be multiplied top and bottom. This x plus 3, we're going to multiply it top and bottom here. And that's what we got here. There's the x plus 3, and we multiplied it top and bottom. The x plus 2, yep, multiplied top and bottom. Now, just leave that on the bottom. You know, just leave it. That's fine. Don't have to multiply it out. Then it's just multiplying these guys across. 4x and the 3x. Those two together make the 7. We've got 9 and 8. There's the 17. And that's how we got the answer. I think... Okay, now, why can't I just Could say seven?